I understand, but I can't come tomorrow. I need to take my son to the dentist. Greetings. My name is Uri. I haven't met any people here in a long time. You say something took your son over the bridge. Then you need to hurry. The forest... I'll help you. Try fixing the bridge for now. In the meantime, I'll climb up the tree. Maybe I'll be able to see something from the top and take this map. It'll help you find your way in our wilds. <laughs> I guessed as much. The dwarf who took your son is my brother. He and I are the last residents of this place. We have to find him, but there's a problem. We're on an island surrounded by an impassable swamp. The raft was the only way to get to the opposite bank. There was a path before, but the lake spirit destroyed it. We can summon the spirit and ask her to take us across. There's a description of the ritual in my house. You handle that, and I'll look for another way. Good luck. How many years I've been here. I'm eternal. But these creatures, their lives for me are just instants. But they managed to ambush me. They came on their ship and stole my pearl. My beloved pearl. They couldn't get far. My curse overtook them. Now their souls are cursed to forever atone for their evils. But my pearl, I can't get it back. It remains on the ship. Bring it to me, and I'll help you leave the fall.
damn. We were just a little too late. A little earlier, and we'd have caught up to them. But now, they're behind the gates. And you know, I wouldn't advise going in there. My brother lost his mind in those damn caves. It's where the terrible evil appeared. I see you are intent on going in there all the same. Forgive me, but I cannot accompany you further. These caves make me shiver in fear, so I won't be much use to you there anyway. I hope you will find your son. Good luck. Before, I imagined people as crude barbarians, but now I know that this is not the case. Disturbed me, human. Do you need help? Very well, then. You can help me, too. I am the spirit of these mountains, and I feed on the life of each living creature in these caves. But when the evil appeared here, I began to lose my strength. Very soon I will become ordinary rock. Bring me a life potion. It will restore my strength, and I will be able to help you. I'm amazed that you managed to get in here. You know, your son is an ideal vessel for the Overlord. You want him back? Well, try. <laughs> Greetings. I have been trying to communicate with you for some time. I know that you want to rescue your son, whose mind has been clouded by dark magic. And in this, you will need my help. In my life, I studied the ancient art of alchemy. I invented a way to stop the evil demon. With the help of the Philosopher's Stone, I managed to turn his body into a gold statue. The spell was so difficult that it cost me my life. I could not finish what I had begun. That is why the monster's soul still lives, awaiting a time when he can be reborn in a new body. My castle can be found on the floating islands. You will find everything you need there to destroy the demon once and for all.
I am glad to see you here. This is my castle. This is where a major development in my life took place. I made the Philosopher's Stone, and the ingredients to create it remain here. But it is also possible to create its reverse by replacing just one ingredient with its opposite. Then, with the help of this substance, you will be able to destroy the Golden Statue once and for all, and with it, the Demon. You will need the Mountain Spirit's help. Among my tomes is the recipe for the potion he needs. Thank you, human. You have returned my strength to me, and I am again able to fight. I know you want to destroy the Dark Overlord, and I will help you. I will give you a stone. It is a piece of my heart. You will need it. Human, look, my lake is coming back to life and becoming how it was in the ancient times. But under the water, at the bottom of the lake, all is not well. The creatures who live there are dying. There is not much time left before life on the bottom will end. I cannot help them. I dearly hope you can stop this. I know people cannot breathe underwater. Look, this is a special potion. It will fill your lungs with air. Unfortunately, it is missing an ingredient, mushroom extract. The dwarf should have it. Greetings, human. I am called Undine, and I am queen of the underwater folk. We have lived here for hundreds of years, but the energy which makes the water of the lake breathable has run out, and we are dying. You are our last hope. A long time ago, a hermit artisan built a device which generated the energy we need. But very recently, one of the core parts of the machine broke. Oh, 
Please, find the hermit. He lives somewhere in the depths of the forest. He must have spare parts. If the device doesn't start working very soon, all of our people will die. <laughs>